percentage of one's own worth by making it a sale. A paper boat that somehow enters my mind before I wake up in the jail of consciousness. I'm gonna raise this up a bit. I hate going Quasimodo when I'm in control. Oh. That's cool. Thank you. I grabbed it out of some sea. I didn't know the iniquities of what it would be if I could find the quotation marks that would set me free. I hung. I hung myself wise on a chokehold, the disguise, something my eyes would not allow me to see. I need to believe something in my heart. An act that would wake me up before there's no punishment, no self to be denied. I am cooling myself on this mountainous sense of help. My Sherpas are asleep. Bang! What is it I hold on to that makes the dew of the morning find an act of poetry? What is it that breaks within the mind where surgery has no inclined plane that finds flight, leaving me pounding on my chest? Waking myself up, wondering if rent is paid. Babies. I spun around. This town of my heart seems to be something, uh, an equation, in which I can figure out balance and symphony. I love the music in my heart. I'm not very aggressive. I find the jumpstart of my life pulls a trigger on a silencer of linguistic ability. I turn away from it as if there's a full moon leaning itself on my quasimoto. My sweet boat and the parable senses of time, a pond in which I float endlessly, a rhyme in which I hope will rescue me. And all I really do is sleep and pray for a dream. Bang. It comes. I wander effortlessly through days, through calendars. The past comes and bite me on one shoulder or the other. Some see that as a reward, a hypodermic, a sweet intention for my mind to find a little bit of alliteration, a great sky, a cloud, a sweet thing that finds its shoulders of my life and it depends upon my words and my words begin to come. I wonder, why did it take so long? Sweethearts, I'm not a white man, I'm not a black man, I'm a cameraman. <laughs> oh. The end of the runway, I find myself looking for a heavy sense of time, something that would give me balance, something that would laugh at the rhyme I make up. Something of my stuff in this Galapagos egg that will not let me go. Showtime of it all with sprinkling light that breaks up into mosaic. Uptight wise my being and looses, my disguise falls away, and there I am, as naked as a lie. Wondering who will believe me. Bang. I go back from it. I cannot stand the way I'm looked upon. This full moon, this crater of doubt, shines at me. Batteries included, it says, and the sweet IV deep in the veins of my literary symphonies wakes me again as I'm standing on the train underneath the ground, the sustainability of going from A to B, hoping when I arrive there's some sensibility waiting just for me. The crowds go by like chocolate cake. I am the mistake buried deep in that darkness. I wait for someone to come out of the heartness of deterioration. Hold me back, I say. Keep me from the worst of my own heart. Help me as I fall apart over and over and over and over. A four-leaf clover that's a plastic rose. I hold on to it. The indelible sense of time that finds its first sentence, its first rhyme. And then I can climb out of this darkness and begin to take my steps into a new day. Ain't it wonderful when your past ain't in your way? Bang. I'm hanging. 
I'm a bat outside of this moon, full with his batteries included, his push upon my heart. I wait for someone to put those magic on my chest to wake me. To say I'm still alive, the jive of my heart is a Bunsen burner, yearning for something I never knew I could invent. The invention of it all is unknown, the stone is being pushed. And yet I look at the stone of tomb, it's unwritten upon. It's my life to be my structured sense of reality that can find language, a neon sign, a chokehold, a design, a sweet, enduring smooch. Mm. I fall back. I allow myself to be a turtle on its back just for a moment. Whatever comes my way, well, I'll take it inside. Let the pride of my life push away in the goodness of whatever the poetry is that flows out of me. Sustainable, unknown, wakes me and says, welcome. No, oh, babies. The word welcome, it, it entrances me. It has to be something good, something more than planetive. Something more than the surgery of one's eye to give language just to help you get by. This is more than that. You are the eye of the moment. You are what you see. You are the believability. You are your heart. Jumpstart. Pull back just for a moment to see if you have any objectivity. Watch yourself form colors, a Matisse sense of life on the canvas. The uptight wise of it falls away, you're loose. Your girdle gets going. You're deep as you spin about on this pond of possibilities. Everything in that roam, everything in that home, everything you remember to be the beginning of the first time you stepped into your own identity comes back at you to make you remember who you are. Just what that star that falls in front of your eyes can mean. And all you want to be is more than your dream. Your dream is wonderful, no doubt about it. It shouts with color and balance and symphony. But when you awake, the clock is ticking and talking. It's time for you to live. How do you do that? My stretcher bearers, I've been released. I said, hey, I can make this one on my own. My Sherpers have left me for this mountain to climb. I'm deep in that lovely aura borealis, that sense of mind, that wonderful, brilliant design that opens until I have to admit I'm alive. Babies, isn't it wonderful to touch what you can't identify that comes back at you and says, Hello, what took you so long, <laughs> babies? The song comes and plays. I am the stave of the do-re-mi. Here is the actual sense of my life lost in this darkness. I cannot find the attic of my despair. The lovely pictures that come with clarity, they disintegrate. For it's my voice without my ventriloquist that has to find the music. And when I do, then it's me. Uh-oh. Then it's you. Ouch. I smooth it all out. The quotation marks, they're hearts, not transplanted. They're sweet arcs of new life that finds the pond of separation between what you want to be and who you are. For the first time in your life, this star is not an act of disintegration. It is exactly who you are. And you admit to it. My nation is my soul. My steps I control. My poetry is my flotation collar in this tsunami of reality. I own it. Yes. Woo. Yeah. Bang. Ain't it nice when that thing finds a flotation collar of design? You wake up again. The stuff of your life, well, it's all possible. It's not that you forget the things that have darkness. 
where Lazarus wears those big glasses and Jesus has too much mascara. <laughs> you are deep just for a moment to be asked and when you are, you step up to it. You love the thing, the invitation. It's no longer a threat. It is something wonderful. You are worthy of the light you see between you and the thing you have always doubted. You are the shout that finds its musicality. No longer do you hunt for that big C in your life. It is you, you and Pavarotti, singing. Ain't that nice? How many times would that be a little squeeze, a little hole, a little eternity? Come on, babies, hold for a while. And when you smile, there's no doubt. In the last mile you take, well, it's the longest curve in your life. Smooth, it's angular, wise to be, has poetry. And the roses of it are not plastic, they are real. Is there anything more beautiful than a rose? Only one, the image you see in that mirror you uncover to look at eternity. Bang. Ain't it nice to be alive? Well, we are all that tonight. We came to find the shroud of it all, the burqa that would set free whatever it was that doubted our virilities. Whatever various sense of music in our hearts would not fall apart, but would be known. The stone of it is on that marquee, that neon light, those letters that delight in knowing who you are. You know who you are? You know me. Bang. I sit now and smile. Everything seems to be taken care of. The glove of life in that compartment of deep, serious mystery is known to me. I do not have to sit a while and think I've missed on something. I am the mistress of that would never find completeness. I watch myself as I burgeon on that little mountain I spoke of before and laugh hysterically. A laugh track owned, not rented. A wing, suppose one to be one wing makes me flop about, but it's a mysterious sense of harmony. And I bang up against that I thought I could never find more than something choking my mind. It all comes as a flirtation sense of reality. I am good for it. I am known for it. I am the stone of my poetry. Bang, babies. Relax. Take the axis of it and be something more than you thought you could be. No one is going to criticize you tonight. The fight of it is owning show up on time. The rhyme of it is just say the truth. One, present the air with something you cannot deny. And with not denying, you're buying your own identity. Ain't it nice when that breaks like an ocean of mistakes and sets you free? Bang, babies, you, me. I'll go off later in the night, find the subway like everyone else. Felt special up here for it to find the words that rush through me. And all of it will be nothing more than everything I have to do every day that takes my ritual, every new or old thing that identifies what I must do just to get by. Everything is buried alive, and yet its heart pumps. It's no disguise of its life to find on the autopsy table of definition. I am that paper boat, that sail, that encumbered sense of every nuance that pushes me toward the jail of freedom. And I like it there. It likes me. Bang, babies. Hold. Oh. It's cold for a while. And then the smile of your own poetry melts away, thaws away the doubt. And the shout of it is you stand with your shoes of taps in a full moon. And the crater of darkness begins to light as you spin ignominiously into a new night. Babies, 
All we have is time, and time is ours tonight. Good night.